many organizations and companies forget that even though you're building an ecosystem digitally, you still need to recognize the humanity of your partner, especially contract uh, uh, manufacturers, for instance. Yeah. So, you know, although it's just email and it's not a meeting or it's, or it's a web uh, meeting and not a physical meeting, you still need to realize that, you know, um, um, across the wires. <laughs> so so right. the, yeah. the story, the lesson from that article still rings true. Yep. That's, that's what's important. Thank you, Kevin. Think about, you were talking Alan. about digital twins, but think about getting to the level of trust where you include suppliers and contract manufacturers as part of your digital twin. That, yes. That's where I want to see things go. Alan, I'm curious, how rare is what you described or what you did? How rare is that even today? Oh, that, I, I have no idea, to be honest, because my experience is pretty narrow in that world. But I think the, I mean... I've seen people treat suppliers and contract manufacturers transactionally, trying to get the best price, you know, yeah. trying to push them on cost and everything. Uh, but I've always kind of believed that you, you have to, do you want your, you know, suppliers and contract manufacturers working for you or do you want them working with you? Right. Mm -hmm. I think everyone would say with. And the only other thing I would say is you can't do it with every supplier, every contract manufacturer. It's you, you don't have the bandwidth, so you have to pick and choose. Yep. Um, all right. So, and and Alan, I loved uh, as you kind of wove in certain parts of your story where some of those exchanges and certainly the relationships are still so valuable to you today. Kind of just as a human, I think that uh, I love hearing stuff like that. So I appreciate you sharing uh, that story. And folks, we dropped. You know, don't take our word for it. We dropped the link to the article across all the social channels there so you can read um, Alan, uh, the full length of Alan's experiences there, how we got to change how we think about and act towards our contract manufacturing partners.